pretty windy day on day two here in Qingdao. Um, yeah, kind of didn't get much racing in and they, they really shortened the, the fleet sizes down to get the racing away because it's just blowing out of the, the buildings and obviously behind me here. S similar type of, types of buildings straight onto the race course which is about 100 metres offshore. So it's getting all these bullets from, from everywhere and I'm really happy with the day to, to make it round and, and not have any damage on the boat and get, get three in the top two on the board. And as today, the one we, we won, we actually, uh, yeah, I pulled the trigger a little bit too early. We were kind of just just uh, just too high on and a few boats really tight to lure. So just pulled the trigger a little bit too early and, and turned what could have been a glamour start into it being over. And yeah, had to wait for quite a while for everyone to clear out so we could... Um, restart the race and <clears throat> yeah managed to pick a few really good shifts up that first beat to be right back in the game by the top mark and yeah job set straight past him on the run and that's one of the, the benefits and downsides of sailing in the shifty stuff is that the guy in last can get through to first or vice versa you know you, you can go backwards pretty easy if you make a few mistakes and you know, we're just happy to have it back on the wall from one piece.